all that money for basketball? This ain't bad for a little hustle, huh, Mark? But you didn't tell him you got a basketball scholarship to UCLA, did you? No, what I'm gonna tell him for? It's a one-time deal. Come off, man. I don't get you. You're crazy. Man, what don't you get? It's easy money. Me and Brenda want to tear the style, you know what I'm saying? Whatever. All that money, I bet you were dunking on him like Jordan. Did you stick your tongue out? Nah, I ain't really stick my tongue out, but I was breaking them off proper, you know what, what? I'm saying? Oh, man. <laughs> but on the real deal, man, you know why I'm so good, though? No, Kenny, tell us, why are you so good? Well, it's genetics, Marcus. And if you're not born with it, you don't get it. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Kenny doesn't know where he got his genes from. Back to you, Brad. I know where they came from. Do you know where they came from? So the store closes about 7 o'clock, so meet me there and don't be late. Man, I'm just gonna run down here and make a phone call to my lady, and I'll be right back. Why don't you just use the phone in the store? Bookman's electric. Nah, man, I need my privacy in the phone booth, you know what I'm saying? Oh, the lovebirds need their privacy. Oh, how cute. Oh, Marcus, man, you just want to come stuff. so you can take notes. Cool, eye. You look at Maddie Will, Miss Dawson. Hey, Mr. Bookman. Home, I got it, I got it, I got it. Take a break, take a break. Yeah. How you doing, Miss Dawson? Hi, how did you bring your coupons no, with you? I did. Wait, wait. Don't worry about that. Wait, wait, after the dance, check this. I got plans you won't believe. <laughs> Unreal. We practically raised that boy's mother. These are good people. It's a damn tragedy. Do you know if he was in a gang? Oh, not Kenny Thompson. Marcus, was Kenny in some kind of trouble with the gangs? I don't know. I guess if you waste the time to ask whether you saw anything. Why do you say that? Because nobody ever sees anything around here. They bury their dead and nobody ever sees anything. And so, a Marvin. I'm talking to this detective. So, talk to me. Anything you say is between us. Nobody else has to know. Suppose I didn't see the gunman, but I did get the license number of the car. Blue Cougar, the broken right tail light. Looks to me like you had in mind to give me this. These are good people. The, the boy's mother, she's never been in any trouble. She runs the beauty parlor across the street there. Was that the smart thing to do, Mr. Bookman? Probably not, Mrs. Bookman. You think I was wrong? It's got to be you, doesn't it, Marvin? Finally, it's got to be me. You know something? I feel damn good about it. Now, son, don't go trying to get your own justice. Cause this ain't right. Yeah, we'll see. Well, aren't you going after him? And do what, honey? Lock him up till he cools down. He's a good kid. He'd come to his senses. He just needs a little time. 